Risotto is fucking cool. To be fancy, I'm gonna throw my hair up. This is how you put your hair up with one hand. Like, I did not know that risotto was rice. I always thought it was pasta. I learned how to do my hair in a ponytail when I was 21. <laughs> it's not. It's fucking rice. Because up until that point, I did it in different ways. And I just never got around to trying it. And then one day I was like, fuck, I want to do my hair in a ponytail. And I just did it. I did it. So that is how you do your hair with one hand. Peeling ungulates. <laughs> Garlic and shallots, they're called something. They're a type of vegetable. I think they're called ungulates, but I also think that's a type of name for things with like cloven hooves, like deer and sheep. Peeling ungulates is hard. <laughs> what if it starts to snow outside and it's the first snowfall of winter and you're like, holy fuck, the first snowfall of winter. You keep stirring your risotto. Risotto is so good. What if, what if a pack of wild otters comes into your house and starts cuddling all over your floor? Keep stirring your risotto. And secretly wish you were with them cuddling. Because the risotto rice, it's just like, it's one of those rices that just takes a while to, to take in liquid. It's just a little more slow at that. This takes so long. You have to really just let it stir, soak up the liquid and the juices. In its own time, you know, it can't be fucking rushed. <laughs> yeah, the stirring part takes a long time, but we don't really ever give ourselves enough time to just really reflect on our lives and the shit that we need to think about and what matters. Stop kitchen, stop kitchen, gluten-free, vegan eats, stop tastic treats. Thank <laughs> you.